What's good, sneaker fam? Welcome back to our sneakers. Today, we are continuing on with the bot series, and today's video will consist of the different kind of bots there are, and which are the most popular, and which one I go with. So, starting off with choosing a bot, there is two main ones, but you know, there's also four options that I'm going to talk about. The first one is another Nike bot. They also go as an all in one bot, or AMB, AIO, however you guys may know it. And this bot does go for $300, and out of all the bots, it is the most popular because it, it is the most used. And I've seen a lot of people succeed off of it. They say that you have 80% guarantee of getting your shoes, but that's not always true. It all depends on how they set up the bot and how you run it as well. So the 80% is if it runs at its full efficiency and not even that. So it's all a matter of luck. So that's with all bots anyways. The second bot there is, is the better Nike bot. It is the second most popular amongst the bots. And I've seen a lot of people use this. I've seen like the same amount of people succeed, but mostly on AMB, I've seen more people succeed because they retweet more people that succeed, but then again, AMB is the more popular one, so it is kind of hard to tell who uses it more. The pros to BMB is that it costs $200 compared to $300 that the AMB cost, but you are getting more sites with the AMB or the AIO bot. You're getting sites overseas, you're getting sites here in the US, as well as independent little stores in the US, other than foot sites, Adidas, and Nike. I'm not exactly sure how many other websites all these other bots consist of, but I know that AMB has the most out of all of them. The third bot there is, is NSB, which is a Nike shoe box. It does cost 130, but you're super limited. I think you're limited to just the four foot sites, Nike, Adidas, and that's about it, I think. I'm, I'm not really too familiar with this because it's not popular at all. I know more people use BNB and AMB than anything else, so there's not really much to say about this bot. If you guys do know anything about it, comment down below if you guys use it. Let us know how it works. And the fourth kind of bots are ATCs, and people usually sell these individually. It's more like a pre-order in my opinion, because people give you the account so you do check out, but basically what you're paying is the profit they're making of the shoe. Let's say it's easy. The shoe costs $200. Some of them might charge you a few hundred bucks and then some of you, some of them might charge you maybe 50, but that's really not, that means those aren't the best bots or the best ATCs, which is stands for automatic checkout. So basically you really want to go with a bot that you can control over you paying somebody that's not even guaranteed to get the shoe. And usually they do refund your money, but it's annoying because you're waiting on them to get the shoe for you, but in the end you don't get it. So. Like I said, the prices vary. People can charge you up to over 100 bucks, 20, 100 bucks, 30 bucks, hundreds, just whatever they want. Uh, and they can charge you as little as 50 bucks or maybe less depending on how much profit they want to make. So going down the list, you do out the four AMB, BNB, NSB, and the ATC. I personally wouldn't go with the ATCs because so many people sell them and I feel like people could scam you. I've never done it, but that's just how I feel. So I wouldn't go with that. I'd probably just drop it off the list. But if you guys are comfortable and have somebody that you constantly get them from, then go ahead and do that. As for NSB, I don't know anything about it or I haven't really heard much of it. So I'll probably just throw it off the list as well. So the ATC and NSB are no go for me. So right now it's basically between the AMB and the BNB. It's honestly a preference of what you want to buy, of what you feel will do better for you. I personally went with the AMB or the AIO, which it is a more expensive one, but you do get more options and that's why I did it. And I've seen a lot, a lot, a lot of people succeed. I've seen people get up to like 10 pairs of Yeezys, which is like, that, that's what drove me in. And that's a crazy amount of Yeezys. That's a lot of profit for the person that got them. So I figured like, why not just go with that one? And at the time I haven't really heard of BNB, but then eventually I caught on to like the bot market and I realized that both of them are competitors. So what I would recommend for you guys, do your research, go with what you feel will be better for you. If you want to go with the cheaper option, go with BNB, go for it. If you want to go with AMB and have more options, go for it. Honestly, it's up to you. Do your research, see where people succeed more, and just go off that. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Also, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe. Make sure you stay woke, we're signing out. Peace.